Makiba, Panomenev and Zdalskov are off. So Makiba is travelling a little uh, closer to his guide. Interesting uh, tactics between... Oh, Makiba's down! Makiba! Oh, that's a shocker for... Uh, the race favourite and Makiba's just got tangled up there. This is always the problem with the three guides and three athletes side by side going at the same time. But Makiba got to his feet quickly. And Makiba somehow has managed to put himself into third position. He's already passed one. This would be one of his great races if he was still to pull it off from here. But I don't think he can. He's too far back. And Makiba... I don't think even the great Canadian can recover from what's happened to him here. Uh, he's got Oleg Ponomarev to deal with first of all, and he's coming up to him. And they're not that far behind Demoden now, as you can see. Makiva gets past uh, Ponomarev, and now he's after the Swede. Oh, don't write him off just yet. Surely he can't, but maybe he can. Brian McKeever, who fell in the first couple of hundred metres, moves up to and passes Moden. Oh, this is fantastic stuff. Brian McKeever. How much time did he lose with that fall? It doesn't matter now. As McKeever and his guide, Graham Nishikawa, come down in front of the crowd here. And McKeever works his way to the front, passes Moden. The Swede is going to finish second or third. It's a good finish for the minor medals, but it's McKeever. One of the great uh, performances of these Paralympic Winter Games. That is some kind of performance. Okay, I stepped on. Okay, this is we came out. Oh.